Assalamu alaikum everyone, yes I'm back with a new video. In today's video, I'll be mixing the NARS blush palette into crystal clear slime. So let's get started. This NARS blush palette has iconic shades which include a range of translucent, natural tones, each with a subtle pink for a natural looking blush undertone to highlight the complexion. Very silky, super fine, micronized powder pigments in matte and shimmering shades. Ensure irresistibly soft, blendable application. This is what the original palette looks like. Taos. Taos. And here is the fake palette that I'm scraping out. Very beautiful soft red with golden sheen. This is what the NARS powder blush Taos looks like when it is stretched. It is a very warm toned medium dark red with a pearl finish. Taos is a rich coppery plum with warm undertones and a pearly sheen. This is what the original palette looks like. Gaiety. And here is Gaiety, which is the fake palette right here. This is a matte vivid pink. This is what the NARS powder blush Gaiety looks like when it is stretched. It is a very cool toned light medium pink with a satin finish. Gaiety is a cool toned cotton candy pink with strong blue undertones and a mostly matte finish. This is what the original palette looks like. Exhibit A. And here is the fake one. Exhibit A matte red blush. This is what NARS powder blush Exhibit A looks like when it is stretched. It is a very warm toned dark orange with a matte finish. Exhibit A is a bright medium dark orange red with a matte finish. Here is the original palette of Outlaw. Outlaw. And this is a fake palette as you can see. A very soft rose tone with golden shimmer. This is what the NARS powder blush Outlaw looks like when it is stretched. It's a very cool toned dark berry with a frost finish. Outlaw is a deep berry with subtle cool undertones and a warmer golden shimmer. This is what the original palette looks like. Liberty. And Liberty, this is the fake palette. It's a very beautiful burnished apricot. This is what the NARS Powder Blush Liberty looks like when it is stretched. It is a moderately warm toned, very dark copper with a matte finish. Liberty, it's a burnt orange red with a very subtle sheen. Here is the original palette, which is a dual intensity blush. This is Adoration. Adoration. And now I'm scraping out the fake palette. Scraping out and more scraping. I am using the Shimmering Hot Pink. This is what the NARS Powder Blush Adoration looks like when it is stretched. It is a moderately warm toned medium fuchsia with a pearl finish. Adoration is a medium dark pink with subtle warm undertones and a satiny sheen. Here is the original palette. Bumpy Ride. Now on to the fake one. This is Bumpy Ride, which is a shimmering candy pink. This is what NARS Powder Blush Bumpy Ride looks like when it is stretched. It is a slightly warm toned light medium coral with a pearl finish. This is what the original palette looks like. Taj Mahal. And on to the fake one. It's a very beautiful burnished orange with golden shimmer Taj Mahal. This is what the NARS Powder Blush Taj Mahal looks like when it is stretched. It is a very warm toned medium dark orange with a frost finish. Taj Mahal is a bold vibrant orange with a hint of red and a golden shimmer sheen. Here are all of the swatches together. Ugh, these are so gorgeous. NARS blush delivers healthy looking colors that enliven the complexion and provides a natural looking flush to flatter any skin tone. As you can see, that's the same thing it does with the slimes. So everyone, if you really enjoyed watching this video, please don't forget to like, subscribe, press that bell icon so you're notified of any future videos that I might post, leave a constructive comment, and share this video. I'll really appreciate it. As always, thank you so much for your support and encouragement. Thanks for watching. Until next time, Allah is Bye. Thank you so much for watching till the end of this video. If you want to watch similar videos, please check out the playlist right here. Check it out!